Yo, so I just remember this freaking uh, story that happened to me a while back. So me and my best friend was kicking it, right? And he had this fine sister. Like, yo, this girl was so fine. She could make a gay dude second guess himself, bro. Like, this girl had a double D tits, a Kim Kardashian booty hole. I mean, bro, this girl's feet was pretty. Nigga, her toes was pretty. And, like, she had a crush on me, right? But I never knew that. Like, I never would have guessed it because, like, she's, like, most popular at her school. And, like, I used to come down to, I used to go to my friend's house, like, every other weekend because he lived across the city, which is, like, 30 minutes away. And, like, his sister was so fine. Her name was Ashley. And, yo, if this girl watched the video, I would go balls deep in your vagina right now. Like, yo, hit me up. I would steal my mom's car. Go over there. I wouldn't even use a con. I would have your babies. Like, yo, babe, I'm, I'm calling you babe, what's good, baby? But, um, yeah, like, one night I slept over, right, and my friend, Michael, he fell asleep mad early, so it was just me and his sister just watching videos, right, what's on YouTube watching Kane Carter videos, shouts out to Kane Carter, and, like, me and her was, like, just, like, we were, like, having this, like, teenage flirt, like, I was, what, 15, this was three years ago, and she was 16, so she was a grade ahead of me, she was a sophomore, I was a freshman in uh, school, so me, we were just like flirting, like, oh my god, like, oh my god, I want to rub my balls across your face, and she's like, oh my god, I want to, you know, let you cream pie my vagina or something, and I was like, yeah, boy, and so me and this girl were just like going at it, we were just flirting, and then we went back upstairs to my friend's micro room and we were just laying down talking about our future. Well, not like a future like outside of what after we do. Well, uh, 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 what we would do after high school one day, that's all I'm doing. So we were just talking about that for a while. And then I don't know where she started kissing my neck and everything. And so I was like, you know what? Nah, Sam, I'm finna go in there, right? So me and her we started making now and I started rubbing her booty and I tried getting them titty balls all in my face. Tried the motorboat and, uh, <clears throat> it got pretty heated after that, so we're just going out, and then she starts stripping to her bra and panties, my nigga. My dick so hard, I can chop cocaine with this motherfucker right now. Like, my dick was hard as balls, nigga. I mean, yo. And then so she started rubbing her hand all over my penis. Yeah, it's finna get graphic, all right? So um, if you're around your mom or whatever, to be like, Ma, Zosh is on, so I'll catch you in a few seconds, baby. And uh, so let's get back to the commentary. So we're just going at it. I'm rubbing her. I'm, I'm, not, I'm rubbing on her vagina, rubbing on that booty hole, trying to. I'm giving, trying to get her a hickey on her neck, and she just thug. She is. Oh my god, she's like dry humping me right now, while my hands on her. Uh, like I'm kind of fingering her, but I'm just rubbing it. Like I'm just rubbing the premises of her vagina. So then. She was like, do you have protection? I'm like, hell no, nah, bitch, I'm 15. What kind of protection you need? I play Call of Duty. You need a frag grenade? What you need? Flag jacket? I got you, baby. And then she's like, no, I need a condom. So uh, we go in Michael's draw and get a condom. And then I put it on, right? Nigga, this was stuff. This was just everything to get all back. Everything just goes downhill. So she's like, I don't know if I should tell you this, but uh, I'm on my period. Exactly. It was that. I was like, what? She's like, yeah, but we can still do it. I was like, bitch, is you crazy? You think I'm finna drive my hot dog in some ketchup? Bitch, you out your mother. Let, uh, bro, I almost, I almost fought a bitch that day. She almost died, like legit. But um, let me get back. But uh, what would you have done in this situation? Would you have went balls deep in her? Or would you even sleep with your best friend's sister who could have possibly ruined your best friend? Relationship for over five years. What would you have done? And another question. Do you think this story is legit or not? Comment below and uh, I'll let you guys know if this story was real or not. So um, that's pretty much the commentary, guys. Comment below and saying if it was real or not. And if would you sleep with your best friend's sister and ruin possibly, possibly ruin your best friend's relationship with yourself, I guess. Um, Yeah, that's kind of getting awkward. I'll, 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 I'll see you guys later. I love you guys. Bye. Two door cool, 400 chips. Jacob Watts cost two bricks. Store another rack if she do a split. I got a bag of mileage, know she wanna lick. Make a girl, kiss a girl. Turn the shit in the Miley world. And then she geeking off them drugs. Making faces like Lil Durr. Don't need a couple of cause I know I'm the shit. All that sights on me, I'm frozen. This bitch look like I'm selling dope, need a stove in this bitch. So these girls wanna fuck like gold in my dick. Everywhere I go, boy, you know the shit lit. His Rolex ticket, that nigga counterfeit. Bitch from the tropics, screaming free ride digs. I only blow gas, don't fuck with the max. Diamonds flashing like paparazzi.